Good morning, this is Jacques de Villiers uh, from South Africa. I'm a professional speaker and trainer. And I'm very privileged to be sitting here with Michael Leander, one of Europe's leading marketing experts. We're sitting in a hotel in Tehran, Iran. We've been on a speaking tour. Michael and I have done two keynotes at this stage. We did an internet marketing seminar the other day and we also spoke at a seminar for the insurance industry. Now the question I have for Michael is in South Africa 15 years ago, maybe even 8 years ago, email marketing was the way to go. We, I run the seminar business and if I sent out a good, a well written piece of copy on the email I could get 50 to 100 delegates in a room. In 2011 and 2010 we're lucky if we get 10 to 20 delegates in a room. So I have noticed that email marketing hasn't been as effective as it used to be. So Michael, I was wondering if you could perhaps give us a couple of tips to help us with internet mark uh, sorry, with email marketing and what are some of the best practices that you could recommend? Yeah. Certainly. Yeah. Well the first the first thing people need to be aware when it comes to email marketing is it's not about the inbox. There's been too much focus on just getting into the inbox. It's really about getting in the mind box of people. You have to create a situation where your audience knows that you deliver value. Because if you deliver value, they'll pay much more attention to your email when it arrives in the inbox. So that's the first thing. The other thing is to, to accomplish that, you need to start the email relationship up uh, in a better way than most marketers are doing today. What that means is that you need to, to uh, be sure that whomever signs up to a newsletter are absolutely uh, aware of what they've signed up for, what the benefits of that is, and you need to reconfirm that immediately in what we call a welcoming program. 99% of email marketers don't do that. And the third thing is, as you know, relevancy is incredibly important. And what it means is you need to know more about your audience so that you can target specific information that is relevant to each of these, uh, each individual in your uh, audience. It's really as simple as that uh, to become successful in email marketing. I like to add, because uh, like you, I travel all over in many, many countries and talk to marketers, and most people think that email marketing is dead. So it's quite amusing to see what the stats are saying about this. Email marketing is growing. In spite of social media and the convenience of social media and social network platforms such as Facebook and Twitter and LinkedIn, YouTube and so on, more people still sign up to, for example, email newsletters than they like or engage with pages on any of the networks I mentioned before. So why is that? It's because habit is second nature. People know what an email newsletter is. Uh, they are used to interacting with email and they find they still find that effort changes, especially because they can access their emails on mobile phones, smartphones, that type of thing. I believe that you're coming to South Africa to present a, a seminar work, a series of seminars. Could you tell us a little bit about that? Absolutely. First of all, it's organized by the DMASA, the, the South African Direct Marketing Association. And it's going to be the, the last week of May or the first week of June 2012. And it will be a two day event uh, where one day we'll focus on email marketing techniques. Uh, with the specific purpose of helping attendees to increase their email marketing results immediately. And the second one will focus on social media marketing. And when I speak about social media marketing, when I do my social media marketing master classes, I also focus very specifically on how do you actually get results. That's all I care about and that's all most marketers care about. And I know there will be some local uh, presenters uh, involved in the event, but whom they are, I, I don't know at this point. Well, I certainly look forward to that event, and I'll certainly come and see you then. Thank you very much for sharing some of your valuable information with us. My pleasure, yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs>